go gentle into that good night. Old age should burn and rave at close of day. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. Though wise men at their end no dark is right, because their words had forked no lightning, they do not go gentle into that good night. Good men, the last wave by, crying how bright their frail deeds might have danced in a green bay. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. Wild men who caught and sang the sun in flight and learned too late they grieved it on its way. Do not go gentle into that good night. Grave men near death who see with blinding sight Blind eyes could blaze like meteors and be gay Rage, rage against the dying of the light And you, my father, there on the sad height Curse, bless me now with your fierce tears, I pray do not go gentle into that good night. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. Just about 10 seconds away from that first stage, starting that entry burn on your right screen, we should be able to see that view live. Stage one entry burn startup. And there is that entry burn that beginning. Alan. This burn lasts about 36 seconds long. Stage two FTS is saved. That entry burn continues. We're just about a minute away from SECO. We'll have a number of events all happen in rapid succession. Uh, it'll Happy be the shutdown. second engine cutoff. Stage one we'll be looking for down. that uh, stage one landing burn shortly after. Yeah, actually, just within a few seconds of each other. It's such a cool view on your left screen, seeing Bob and Doug on Dragon. Right now, you can see the displays that they are seeing right now themselves. Terminal guidance. And back there, all up. We are coming up 25 seconds or so away from SECO, or second engine cutoff. This is also the point where Bob and Doug are experiencing their highest G-force. We're seeing the counter tick up to right about 1.8. Copy, Shannon. You heard Shannon, so that just means they're in their final abort zones. If they were to abort at this point, would either be in abort to orbit or to land off the coast of Ireland. Standing by for second Stage one line cutoff start confirmation. And back there, I'll step. And back shut down. Stage one landing line. Confirmation of Seco second engine cutoff. Now we are waiting for our first stage to make its way to our drone ship. Of course, I still love Dragon, you. Dragon, SpaceX, nominal orbital insertion. Launch escape system is nominal orbital Dragon, insertion. Dragon, 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 nominal orbital Dragon, insertion. Deploy. And what you're seeing on your screen is a live view of our drone ship, where our first stage will be coming down. Looks like we lost that live view, but we'll wait for confirmation of that landing shortly here. Falcon 9 first stage is successfully landed. And there you can see on your screen, Falcon 9 has landed. This is the first Falcon 9 to carry humans to orbit. So very exciting for us. 
And as you can see on your right screen, Bob and Doug are still making their way to their targeted orbit. Have one to recovery one. So exciting today. Come on, <laughs> it sounds like we had an expected LOS loss of signal with one of the ground stations. Waiting for confirmation now of that. Signal. Dragon separation confirmed. Dragon separation <laughs> confirmed. There is a great view right in front of you Count of dragon separation. separating. Separation and there's that call out. Dragon is now officially making its way to the International Space Station today. Dragon SpaceX with that separation call. Uh, we have a few words for you from our Falcon 19. Standing by. Dragon, Chief Engineer on Dragon to Ground. Bob Doug, on behalf of the entire launch team, thanks for flying with Falcon 9 today. We hope you enjoyed the ride and Wish you a great mission. Thanks, Bala. Congratulations to you and the F9 team for the first uh, human ride for Falcon 9. And it was incredible. Uh, appreciate all the hard work and uh, thanks for the great uh, ride to space. Copy all. Bala, I'd like it. Proud of you guys and the rest of the team. Uh, Thank you so much for what you've uh, done for us today, putting America back into low Earth orbit from the Florida coast. Got the other. Good luck. Godspeed.